Happening today, state lawmakers returning to work for the next 90 days as this year's legislative session heats up in Annapolis. ABC 2 News' Brendan McNamara joins us live from outside the state house. Brendan, there's a lot on the table this session. That's right, Ashley. And thanks to some lower than expected revenues last year, the state is in a deficit for the session this year to the tune of $209 million. So a lot of big choices need to be made and a lot of issues are on the table as those lawmakers return to work starting today. One of the biggest issues that everybody seems to be talking about here is the push <laughs> to require employers to provide sick leave for workers. Top Democrats talked about this yesterday at the party's annual legislative luncheon held on the day before the session starts. Governor Hogan, a Republican, actually proposed Post his own version of the idea last month, which would require sick leave for companies with 50 or more employees. Smaller companies would get a, a tax break. When it comes to the environment, lawmakers need to decide whether to extend or get rid of the ban on fracking in the state. Right now, Governor Hogan supports fracking with strict safeguards in place. Many Democrats will be fighting to keep that ban going. Several other issues are on the table as well, uh, including the right to die bill for terminally ill patients. And all of this actually is setting up uh, a governor race that is coming ever closer. 2018, Governor Hogan uh, expected to run for his seat again. Some of these lawmakers here may be challenging him.